everybody. Allow me to introduce a new type of video. My spotlight on a figure. And this time I'm going to take a look at the Hot Toys Eric Draven the Crow figure. There are plenty of great reviews on YouTube, so I'm not going to review this figure, but I'm going to take a closer look at the figure and the movie as well. The figure comes with a decent amount of accessories. The crow and a stand for the crow, three pairs of hands, and then his signature guitar from the movie. And this is an Ibanez type guitar. He also plays a Fender type guitar in the movie, and there has been a debate on YouTube of which guitar is the right one, but this type is just as right as the other. So the crow can go on the stand here, and it can. He positioned so it looks like it's flying round Eric Draven's head. An extra accessory, so to speak, is this piece of cardboard from inside the box. It also represents a scene from the movie, and it's a quite cool and useful for taking photos of this figure. And speaking of the movie, if you haven't done so already, then go watch this classic movie. It's a tragic story, and it's even more tragic that actor Brandon Lee was accidentally shot and killed during the production, so it was his last movie. Now let's take a closer look at the details. Here we have Eric Draven's ring that he wants to give to his girlfriend, and besides that, there are a lot of great details in his clothes. The jacket he's wearing is old and dirty and full of holes, as you can see here. He's wearing all black, and you can remove the coat, and underneath he has leather pants and a pair of boots here. All of this is very well made, and looks exactly like the stuff he was wearing in the movie. And then we have his eyes. They are amazing. The figure is looking up, but I find that when you turn his head, it almost looks like he's staring directly at you, no matter which way his head turns. Eric Draven uses guns in the movie, but Hot Toys have no guns or gun-holding hands included. But it's no real big deal, because you can easily switch hands with other figures and use their weapons as well. Here's a size comparison next to some other 12-inch figures, a Hot Toys Berserker Predator and an Art Figures Judge Dread figure. And finally, let's take a look at the box that the figure came in. And it's a pretty standard Hot Toys box with this image on the front and really nothing more. So. Thanks a lot for watching this Hot Toys Eric Draven The Crow Spotlight. Take a look at this figure, take a look at the movie, I recommend both. Thanks for watching, leave a comment or subscribe if you'd like to see more.